Dzień dobry, jak się masz? That's hi, how are you in Polish? Uh, my name is Kathy Jakuki, I'm a senior on the women's basketball team and I'm from Violin, New Jersey. I'm studying psychology. I'm excited this week to do a video blog with you rather than just a written blog. Um, our week this week was kind of steady, kind of slow. We played Wilberforce earlier this week. It's always nice to play our friends um, just nearby. Although the game itself, we really kind of struggled to come out with focus. Um, just as a team, we weren't really playing well together. We did come out with a win, but it was a struggle for us, and I think we were ready to move past that game. After the game, we were able to sit down and have a meal with Global Force. Got to get to know them a little bit better. Um, Kara's grandmother also brought some really, really good cookies and brownies that we enjoyed. Um, so thank you very much for that. Wednesday, we weren't supposed to practice, but we decided, uh, the coaches decided we should have like a 45 minute practice. And we came in thinking, uh, I think the worst, but we ended up just chatting about some things. And uh, when Coach Mar Martin was finishing up, he pulled out this noisemaker, which Kara actually recognized from a previous wedding they attended, um, and just started blowing this noisemaker and started yelling, party time. Um, I think we were all very confused and Coach Flunker brought us out ice cream and <laughs> we got to enjoy some ice cream together and had a, a light shoot around. So that was a very nice surprise. Um, I think we all really enjoyed that. Um, Thursday we had a good tough practice and Friday uh, was a lighter practice because we were facing Urbana on Saturday. Urbana we faced earlier uh, just a couple weeks ago here on our home floor and we lost by three. It was a very difficult loss for us um, and I know we've been preparing to play them again um, and to play well. During the Urbana game, uh, I think, at least for me, I know it was a roller coaster of emotions. We they stayed with us and we played hard. Um, during the second half there was a, a time when we had about a 10 point lead. Um, they crawled back and within the last minute uh, it got tied up and we went into overtime. Um, we did get a shot off out of the buzzer but it got blocked. I think it was Reagan Ryan who shot the shot. Going into overtime, um, we ended up winning with five points. Kayla hit two free throws which were big for us. Um, Lauren got a layup in and Kayla hit another two free throws to really give us the solid win. Um, I know after that game, uh, I think a huge relief, uh, that's how we all felt, and we, uh, we did have a condition about Urbana. If we won the game, we were allowed to go eat out afterwards, but if we lost the game, we had to come back and eat at Chuck's. So I think we were all thrilled that at the end of the game, when we huddled up, we could say, no Chuck's. Um, and Coach Martin went on to have a nice evening with his wife, and I think the win really uh, just gave a good feel for the rest of the night for him. Um, this week, we are looking at a few different things. We play Central State at home tomorrow night. We also have Coach Martin's birthday coming up. I think he's turning maybe 37, 38, something like that. Um, well, at least we'll say that's what it is. And we also play our last home game on Saturday against Malone. That's also our, our senior day. We'll be recognizing myself and Kara and other seniors on the basketball team for the men's. Um, this week we're also raising money and selling these pink shirts for uh, breast cancer awareness. And we'll be selling them for $5 and all the money goes to the Cancer Foundation. Um, so we're really excited to be selling these shirts and raising money um, for this good cause and we'll also be wearing our pink uniforms on Saturday which are always a fun thing to get to wear for a game. So we're really excited for this week and so excited to finishing up our regular season. We're really looking forward to senior night. Um, I know for Kara and I, it's a little different. She was here all four years. I was only here for about two. Um, I think it's great to see Kara really finishing up strong for season and I know um, this year has meant a lot to her and she's been working really hard um, and I know we are all looking forward to recognizing her. And for me, it's been it's been a different road for me, but I've loved it. I love being a part of the program and a part of this family. Um, I look forward to seeing the girls move forward in their um, 
just even being in the NCAA and how they do. Um, I'm excited to see them grow. I'm excited to see them mature and to come back and watch them play. And to even be an encouragement um, even as I graduate. Although we're finishing up a regular season, we still have the Ohio Independent um, Tournament and also the NCCAAs, which we're looking, uh, our goals are to win both of those. And so, as we finish our regular season strong, we also look forward to going into strong into our postseason tournaments. Thanks for watching this week's blog, and I'm Kathy Chikuki, and thank you for all your support.